ladies and gentlemen, I'd like you to meet a young man who's been with us a couple of times before. He's uh, very, very talented and, and quite unusual, and, but very gifted. Here is Andy Kaufman. <laughs> Thank you very much. Right now I'd like to sing a song. The next song I'd like to sing is one that I wrote a few years ago uh, for a show that I was doing every week in Boston. Uh, it was a children's show and uh, it was called Uncle Andy's Fun House and this is a song that we used to sing on it. sing the song together. Okay? Would you like to do that? How many people would like to do it? Would like to sing it together? Okay. How many people would not like to do it? Okay, then, then we'll sing it together. Now this time, I'll sing the name of the animal and you sing what the animal says. Okay? Okay? Everybody say, okay. Okay. Okay, very good. And we'll all sing when we get to the lion. Everybody say, roar, real, real loud. Okay, let's try it. One, two, three. Oh, come on now. You could do better than that. Come on. One, two, three. Very good. And okay, and we'll all sing. And that's the way it goes together. Okay? Okay, come on, everybody. Okay. Okay. Okay, here we go. The cow goes, and the dog goes, and the cat goes, and the bird goes, and the pig goes, and the lion goes, and that's the way it goes. Thank you. You surprised me. You caught me off guard. I didn't know you were finished, Andy. Oh, I was. <laughs> because nobody, you know, it's very hard when people are performing to figure out what the ending is <laughs> unless someone has told you, and I had never seen you do that before. Ah, well, that was the end when they say that's the way it goes. Oh, I see. When did you, uh, when did <laughs> you start doing uh, what you do? Well, when I was... Um, Th and this is true. When I was, uh, from the time I was very little, 
uh, I started. Now, you know, a lot of people say that uh, what I'm doing is comedy. And I want to get one thing straight, is that I'm not doing comedy. It's w what I was doing in my bedroom all those years. And not, as I was growing up, I was, uh, I would, I actually believed that there was a, well, for instance, when I was nine months old, I was in the crib, and my mother told me this, and uh, we used to have a record player. I'd put the records on, and I'd, I'd, I'd lip sync them, and uh, all the relatives would come and clap along and, and, you know, watch me and laugh and everything. And that's when it started. Does, that, I don't bother, does that bother you when people laugh at you since no, you're no. not doing comedy? No, well, I, it shows me that they're having a good time. You see, uh, as I was growing up, I really believed there was a camera in the wall, and then I'd put on a whole afternoon of, of programs television programs, and some of them would be comedy, and some adventure, and some tragedy, and some musical, and, uh, it were, but not all of them were comedy. You're a television baby. You grew up so, with television, yeah. right? So I, so I, what I'm doing now is all these same shows I was putting on then, and now I'm doing them real, but mm -hmm. people are laughing, but not all of them were comedy. Your foreign immigrant character, which you did the, when you were here last, and you never deviated from that. You stayed right with the character. I was never able well, to talk to you like I'm not talking to you. How well, did that, that happen, that character? How did that come about? Uh, well, no, as, I, as I was um, growing up, I found that the, the, uh, when I had to go to school, the, um, <laughs> on the playground, you know, I couldn't stay home and do these programs. So I ha had to do them on the playground. So I'd be in the woods uh, doing these shows. Uh, Get away from me, what are you talking about? Uh, get your hands off, you know. All by yourself? All by myself, but the kids would look and they'd say, this guy's cr crazy. Yeah. So I would, I would. Uh, that that would, would be a natural reaction for kids, so if the guy's out there all by himself well, doing well. that, you know. Uh, yes, so, but then one day, one kid comes into the woods, he see, watches me, he thought it, it was very fascinating, you know, and, and, uh, and then a few more kids were coming, and uh, after a while, I found that, the playground <laughs> was in yeah, the woods. And, and, I, and I had an audience, mm -hmm. you know, so... Uh, is it easy for you to switch accents and... Well, th I'm getting to... Oh, I, excuse me, I'm sorry. I, ...that I uh. came upon this uh, character, the immigrant, is uh, when I came to the con this country first, uh, all I found I wanted to be in uh, show business. So... Uh, I found that if I just make my voice higher... With an accent. Yes. Uh, then it would be very innocent. And then the, uh, uh, the people would, would like it. And uh, that is uh, how I was able to do it. Did so instead of saying, thank you, thank you very much, I could do it, I could do it uh, raise you. my voice. Thank you very much. Like, like this. Yeah. And that's, that's, that's my story. Yeah. Yeah. Did you did you develop that in the woods, that high voice? No, 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 no. This is what happened when I was in this I was in this country, and I I thought I want to be in show business, so I sh I should do something that the people are going to like. So I thought I make my voice higher, and uh, it, it, uh, if I'm an immigrant, and then I thought well I should uh, develop this. I was in watching television, seeing all these people talking. I thought I should develop an American accent. And uh, that way, uh, I could develop, use the innocence together with, uh, you know, uh, the other thing. Mm -hmm. And uh, then I have, an, uh, I, I have American accent. So I yes. develop, so I develop American accent. And I was watching television this, uh, in May one time, it's Captain Jack. And uh, Some local show? Yes, it was Captain a children. Jack. And I thought, this is a good man for me to do. And I thought, all right, I will, I will uh, develop this, uh, this man, this character. And so I call it my American character, Andy. Now wait, you mean what you were just doing, you were talking to Michael in an American accent. This no, is not what? your accent. No, 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 no. This is not something that I, I want to uh, talk about, really, because I want the people to think that it's my real voice. Uh, yes, so, so now you are speaking as you really speak. Because this show is interested in the truth. <laughs> and so I, so I am talking this way, but I hope that people will just forget it. <laughs> you know. Yes. Uh, I no, no, what I no, mean no, is, this, this is, is your natural accent, what you're speaking in I am now. only telling the truth. 
No. Y yes, I know that. Yes. Oh, no, you wouldn't lie. No, I don't mean that. I mean, no. your but, accent that but you have now, yes. so this is you. So all I have you. to do is go like, like, uh, <laughs> like, uh, wait, hello, hello, thank you very, very much, thank you very much, thank you very much, very much, thank you very much, thank you very much, thank you very much, hello, hello, and then I have this. Then I have this. Hello, everybody. Hi, how are you? <laughs> like, terrific. Like that. Amazing. See? <laughs> but as far as it to switch accents is, uh, to switch accents, uh, all I have to do to do the foreign immigrant is to make my voice higher. Yes. And I go, thank you very much. Hello, how are you? But uh, to Hi, come from American to, to my real thing. voice is, is easy. But to go from this to American, it take a few a little while. Because the American accent is the one that's difficult for you. It's the one that uh, took the most work. Is the one that, that I have developed. From Brooklyn, you see. I no, 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 no. No, where are you no, from? No. Where are you from, Annie? What the difference does it make where a man is from? <laughs> uh, have equal oh, I'm sorry, I, I asked. I have traveled. Uh, I, I, as I was raised, I was uh, throughout Europe, uh, Africa, and different countries. Oh, but what no, difference no. does it make? It doesn't uh, make any difference. I simply want to. Was a, it was just a, a harmless <laughs> question. It meant nothing. It was no, no undertones. Nothing. Just. Straight ahead question, where are you from? The guy says, down the block here. You know, just no, one of those no, questions. It doesn't make any difference because I don't uh, want to Well, it does to me to because, you see, I've got to keep it moving here. Do you know, I saw this man <laughs> long before you did or anybody in the improvisation in, in Los Angeles. Oh, no, Los Angeles. in yes. Los Angeles. I, I started in the improvisation in uh, Los Angeles and in New York. We have one. Yes. Mm -hmm. And uh, he had Harvey Corman there, and uh, my agent, Tony Fantosi, and he had all of the William Morris office coming to see this man. And we, I thought perhaps at first we caught him on an off night, but then I realized that, that, it was, that this is the, most, the funniest thing I've seen in a long time, although he didn't mean to be funny. I understand. I realized. I'm yes, sorry to say that Yes, because I was just doing funny. what I do in my room. I was yes. doing it. And Excuse uh, me. I'm sorry. I did. I but you got rid of the flashlight. He's going to sing for us right after these messages. We'll be right back.